Welcome to another weekly video. I'll show you some of the common methods to troubleshoot any problems you might have with the batteries. Let's get into the video. One of the most common problems that many solar light users have is that the light doesn't turn on after replacing the batteries. This can be caused by multiple different factors. So let's first start with the general inspection. For your solar outdoor light, make sure it's clean, make sure it turns on and located in a sunny spot where the battery can properly be recharged by the solar panel. And please note that the sunshine angles change depending on the latitude and also the time of year. And for better results, you might want to adjust the solar panel for your garden lights for a better sun reception. For the battery, make sure it's compatible with your light and you can do this by comparing them with the previous batteries you're using in your light before, or you can check the solar light manual. And for brand new batteries, make sure to remove the pull tab for the battery compartment or the plastic cover around them and make sure they go into the solar light correctly based on their positive and negative signs. And for older batteries, make sure they don't have any physical deterioration like leaking or swelling. And remember that the batteries have lifespan too, so it might be time to replace them. Or the reason the light doesn't turn on at night is because of a nearby light source is too bright. And this tricks the solar light into thinking that it's still morning. But all you have to do is move it away into a darker area and this should fix the problem. And for those of you whose lights still don't turn on, let's move on to the next step. We'll assume the batteries are the main cause here, and we'll confirm this by simply putting them into another solar light or into another device such as a TV remote control. If the device turns on, then we know that the batteries aren't dead and the real culprit is the solar light itself. You might need to contact the manufacturer for more help on that. And if the device doesn't turn on, then the batteries are most likely dead. Now we need to figure out why the batteries are dead. Are they defective or are they just not get enough charge from the solar light itself? One way to find this out is to use a charger to recharge them. If they are defective, some chargers will give an error message or appear as blank or null. Another option is just to leave them in the charger and wait a few hours to charge them up. And then you can test them again by placing them back in the solar lights or another battery powered device. And if the devices are still not working, then the battery is most likely defective and you can check with your manufacturer for replacement if it's still within the warranty. However, if those batteries are recharged to full and work on your light or device, then this means that the solar light didn't give enough power to recharge your batteries. You can try to fix this by cleaning the solar panel if it's dirty, or try moving the solar lights in a different location to get better sun reception. Again, if none of this fixes the problem, try contacting your solar light manufacturer for further help. And that's it for today's video. We hope you are now able to fix your solar light problems. And thank you so much for watching. If you found the video helpful, please like and subscribe. And we'll see you next time.